Yes, it is Thinking Out Loud with Khadija and here's another episode where we get to do a little chit chat. So, um, today we're going to quickly, um, I'll try to make this quick as well, uh, talk about giving chances. When I say giving chances, I mean giving your partner a chance to actually help you. Yes! Giving your partner a chance to actually help you because I kind of feel like, you know, when it comes to partnerships and you know being with someone at the end of the day we benefit from each other we help each other grow and I kind of feel like some people really do understand that being in a relationship with a person is service to the other person we're serving each other you're serving me I'm serving you you're doing the things I want I am doing all the things you want to service to each other helping each other out so some people really understand that but sometimes you might end up with a partner who doesn't even know why we're here in the first place, all right? And here you are, you know, you're trying to render service to this person, um, you know, you're doing the things that they like. Sometimes you will find yourself in positions where some things you need to do or say are necessary for you to do or say, especially maybe you want to correct something or help them be better. Exactly, I think that's the phrase. Help them be better at something, in something, or regarding a certain situation. But they may not see it that way, and then they make it difficult for you actually, for you to actually, you know, um, be of help to them with regards to helping them be better in certain places. They don't see the picture that you see, or you know, for some people who find it hard to do with change, and you know, um, re. re I don't want to use the word rebranding. I mean, branding? No, but yeah, change, you know, assessing things over again and, you know, maybe in sometimes fixing themselves. But at the end of the day, the aim is for them to become better people. So sometimes we make things difficult for our partners. Either when they say something, we overreact and we feel like, oh, they're trying to criticize us unnecessarily. They don't know what they're talking about you know they're trying to control us you know yeah sometimes we do make make it difficult for them to render that service to us you know and it can be very frustrating for that partner who's really just genuinely trying to help out and help you be a better person you know because at the end of the day sometimes the way we view ourselves is different from the way our partners view us and sometimes the things our partners would see are very different and much clearer than the way we would see it and understand it sometimes they have a better understanding and they kind of already know how things will end if you approach things a certain way or do things a certain way or say things a certain way or you think a certain way and then they're trying to help us you know um, fix that change that you know but sometimes we tend to resist all of these changes and you know conflicts will arise and then the person begins to feel frustrated so guys out there for the ladies, for the fellas, allow your partners to help you listen, all right? At least acknowledge that, okay, this thing you're talking about, I hear you. If it's something that you can explain, I, you know, break it down to the person, let the person realize, okay, this thing I've done or this thing I've said or this thing I'm thinking, where I'm thinking it is because so, 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 and so, this is how it makes sense to me. This is how I view it at the moment. These are the things I expect to come out of this when I use this approach, blah, 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 blah. But I hear you and I see what you're saying. I will put in, into consideration. Maybe if there's an next time and that kind of situation comes up, um, I will try the way you have suggested and then we see you know, the results from there. But acknowledge when the person is trying to help you. At the end of the day, it's trying to help you. So let's try as much as possible to just, you know, be calm, think about it, you know. And I kind of feel like for most of the guys, they'll probably just look at you like me. Because I kind of feel like they have more of an approach of when you say something to them or when you suggest something to them, they're like, I beg, I beg, I beg, I don't want to listen to this right now, blah, blah, blah. But eventually they may think about it. They may now, you know, go ahead to um, do it the way you said or suggested. You know, but initially they will resist. You know, some ladies are like that. In fact, some women are like that. Ugh. Yeah. 
well hey it's just one of those things and i think it's just easier when we allow each other thrive and blossom we help each other to thrive and blossom as well and we have to allow our partners be able to even do that in the first place because it gets to get to a point where they'll just leave you and just be looking at you and you know because they feel like hey if you take this step you might make an error and you don't listen all the time they talk to you about this eventually they'll just leave you alone and then you'll be by yourself and then you may now begin to ask yourself like ah boom my partner saw me going towards this direction why didn't he or she say anything they've always tried to do so but you never listened or you always resi resisted and it's not encouraging for them it actually frustrates them as well and it also makes them feel like ah, if i can't talk to you if i can't help you who will you know so yeah um let's you know try as much as possible to allow our partners to help us to render that service to do you know carry out their duties the way they feel they should you know at, 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 the, at the end of the day there's gonna be a lot of trial and error if you try it to see if it does if it works or not if it doesn't work you know just sit down head to head but try as much as possible to acknowledge that you've heard them you've let you you've actually listened to what they've said and you will put it into consideration you may even try it out and see or also explain that you see where they're coming from but you perhaps may have tried it in the past or there are certain reasons why it might not work out the way they see it because they might know they might not know something that you know you know at the end of the day it's all about communicating but also acknowledging things you know tends to help quite a bit as well so yes long and short of it is allow your partners to help you don't frustrate their lives